Hey guys, what's up? I'm Greg from GetConnectedMedia.com and I'm going to show you how you can tether your iPad Wi-Fi to your iPhone. So it's pretty easy, you just need to jailbreak one of the two devices. Your iPhone doesn't actually have to be jailbroken, which is cool if you don't like messing around with that. But you do have to jailbreak your iPad. So jailbreakme.com, jailbreak your iPad, and then hit up the Cydia store, which is third-party apps, and uh, you can pay for some of them with your PayPal account. Pretty easy, and they're trustworthy. I've used them for a few years, and they're great apps that bring some great functionality. So you're gonna wanna launch Cydia, and you're gonna to wanna to go to the Cydia store. And it's about $5, actually exactly $5. And uh, you, one time fee, you download it, and you always own it. You can always, if you get a new iPhone or a new iPad, you can always go on, you can always get that app back by verifying your account. So you download the app, install it, and then once installed to tether, just make sure Bluetooth is turned on on your phone, launch the app and press the little on button. Instantly it's gonna launch enable Bluetooth on here. Uh, you can turn Wi-Fi off because you're not going to need it. So now you should see your iPhone 4 there, make sure it's discoverable. Click it and now they're going to want to pair. Input the pairing number and now they are, they are now tethered together. So you're going to see the tethering on the iPhone here and the iPhone thinks it's tethering to your laptop. So that's how you tether your jailbroken iPad Wi-Fi to your non-jailbroken iPhone and use the data that you're already paying for. I'm Greg from GetConnectedMedia.com. See you later.